I'm taking my rig for the first time away from home and go to the Swiss Star Party on top of the Gornigl Summit close to Bern. And while we're there, I tell you six reasons why also you should go to a star party. Let's go. Hey, this is View Into Space, I'm Sascha from Switzerland, so grüezi miteinander and thanks for watching my channel. So the Swiss star party is happening every year and it belongs to the top 10 star parties all over the world. It's on top of Gornickel Summit, which is 1600 meters high and close to Bern. So it's already about two weeks since I was there and for me it's still a very unforgettable experience. So I thought I actually group it in six reasons why I feel it's an absolutely great experience to do this. And I think the first reason definitely is that you go to a dark side. And that means you can do better data than usually at home. And this is especially true when we talk about broadband data. And that's why I chose Andromeda. For Nebula, which you can shoot with narrow band, the light pollution is less an issue than with galaxies or star clusters. At the other side, you still at least, in these parts of the world, you have to be lucky that on such a fixed date, there really is clear sky. And in this case, we were actually very lucky. Just as soon as it got dark, the clouds disappeared and we could actually shoot through the whole night. And this is actually the picture I got out of it. The next reason is definitely to check out the rigs of other people. And while I obviously got a lot of attention with my rather exotic rig, it was also very interesting to see what other people are having. And it was definitely an experience to see this astrophysics scope and also the very huge Dobsonians that were around. Point three is the personal connections. The good part is, especially when you do astrophotography, that it takes about 15 minutes to set everything up. The rest of the night, you have time for talks. And it was really great for once, not to just sit here and do some one directional communication, but really be able to talk to people and share the experiences. The fourth reason is, as ironic as it might be, visual astronomy. And I sometimes make fun about visual astronomy, but still being able to look through a huge Dobsonian and see Saturn or Jupiter or star clusters, it's quite nice. And there were a lot of fellow astronomers who generously let me peek through their scopes. Number five, and this I found especially striking, is simply the dark sky without any scope just lying there and looking up in the sky and seeing as many stars as I could have never imagined living in my light polluted area. So yes, we were lucky. It was very warm through the whole night, but it was just amazing. Just lying on the parking space, just looking up and watching the Milky Way and the star showers. And last but not least, it was also the nature. Simply being a whole night in the mountains, seeing the beautiful landscape. It was just a very good feeling again, reconnecting with nature. 
if you have been at star parties, you want to share some experiences or do some recommendation, please leave it in the comments below. See you next time and clear skies.